Yo, what's good? It's your boy TRNT, and I'm back one more again. This time I'm back with a brand new album reaction. It's a new artist debut, too, for me at least. Uh, I, unlike the other YouTubers and reactors, I never even heard of this guy. He, he go by Buddy. I don't know what type of music he make. This is like a kind of first time hearing slash album review. But anywho, like I said, unlike them, I listen to the whole song. I don't skip. I don't pause. And at the end, I get my commentary. I grade each song from zero to ten, ten being the best. So if it's a trash song, y'all already know that's five and below. If it's mid, average, okay, that's a six. If it's a good song, that's seven to ten. So make sure y'all leave y'all grade and stay to the end. And um, we on live right now. So if y'all want me to react to something, let me know on Twitch. So make sure y'all subscribe to all my social medias at Lil Trent Music. It's spelled the same way as my channel. And live, make sure y'all hit the fucking subscribe button. It don't cost. You dig? Anywho, let's do this. First time hearing from Buddy. Don't forget the breathe. Fucking panties on a bunch of making reaction bits. <laughs> I hate you niggas that make reaction bits. <laughs> Should have known. Like, for me, God speak to me in music. Like, that's why my name is Trent Music. I feel like I am God. I am an image of God. I'm not saying I am the God, but I'm I'm God. I'm, I'm part. But that's another deeper conversation. But this type of music make you feel. I say, man, my whole thing with music, and I tell y'all this when I do my reactions, man. You got four things music do. It should hit your, it's four things. It touches. It hits your, first music hits your ear. You know what I'm saying? That's the way you hear it. Sometimes music is just for you to hear it. It's sometimes for you to hear it go in and out. You dig? When you hear it, it goes in and out. It's supposed to go in and out the ear. Then you got music that move your body. 
It make you, it make you move. It make you want to dance. It make you, you know what I'm saying? It move your body for whatever reason. It just talks to your body. Then you got music that hits your mind. You hear it, but it go up there. It sticks. You think. And then you got music that hit the heart. Matter of fact, your heart beats with the music. It's a rhythm. When you feel that rhythm, that's that heart. <laughs> and the fifth one that nobody talks about, music that hits your soul. Like, it's, you don't know why you like this music. You don't know what it do to you. It just hits your soul. Like, you love this fucking music. I'm going to tell y'all, this damn near punching the soul, but I feel that hell in my heart, and I'm hearing it. And, like, I'm like, this dude can rap. It's good quality music, like, and I say God speaks to me through music. Because last year, 2023, Killer Mike put out what I thought was the album of the year, the best album of the year to me. And I, I'm not just talking about rap albums. I'm talking about all, a lot of people albums. I'm not talking about Beyonce, Taylor Swift, and all that stuff, but a body of work, Killer Mike had the best body of work to me, and it touched me. It was it was like preaching to me, and it got me through um, 2023, but it also jammed all last year, and it still jammed, so that same album won the Grammy, so... This year, I'm going to do the same thing. It's albums that I'm listening to because I'm listening for what's going to be in my top 10 albums of the year, my top 10 rap albums of the year. And let me say, this body of work, just for the songs I heard, is already going to be in my consideration of rap, top rap album of the year. And I've been listening to a lot of rap albums, all the music that do everything. But when I say that shit hit your heart, and first of all, if music don't hit your heart and your mind, if it don't hit my heart and my mind, one of the two, I'm not considering it for that. Unless it was a fun, just fun, boogie album. You had to have me boogieing all throughout. <laughs> like Cardi B, when she had an album, that 10 track album she had, it was a good kid. It was hits, hit after hits. It was a nice album. But I wouldn't say that would be my favorite album. You get what I'm saying? So... This will be in my consideration, and buddy, I can say I'm a new fan. I'm about to discover some new music. I'm definitely going to listen to the rest of the album. I don't know if I'm going to do it with y'all. Fuck it. I like this album so much. I'm going to go on here and react to some more. I said I wasn't even going to do all this. I wasn't even planning on listening to do, but I think God told me, like, for something. I just seen the album cover, all the, all the new music. I was like, who is buddy? He was in the water, like, probably getting baptized. Maybe I need to get baptized. Maybe I need to listen to it. He's talking some real shit. I'm feeling it. But, uh, yeah, man, shout out to Buddy. Let's check out one more. Click the next video if you're rocking it, man. Right?